Honey, are you sure about this? Yes, I am, dear. But he's just so young. It hasn't even been a year yet. Darling, we've been living in enough lies. If we love him as much, then this is best. I see. Hey, Mom, Dad. I'm gonna take out the garbage right now. Son, it's okay. Don't worry about it. You sure? Of course. Audie? Honey, we need to talk. Okay. Do you know who we are? Yeah. You're my mom and dad. No, dear. Before us, the man in the black hat, the adoption guy. Do you know who you were before then? No. And I'm not sure I want to. Son, the reason why we brought you to the table is because we haven't been sincere ourselves. In the interest of fairness, it was only nine months we had you. But in this short time, you touched us in a way we thought such feelings never existed. It's time you knew the truth. My name is Hal Donoff, and this is my wife Alana, as you know. Son, have you heard of a legend called Earth? The blue world that sits in space. The myth. I'm afraid it's not a myth. It's true. The stories? The ancient rescendant movement? All of it. It's technology. Human rescendancy. World War Three. Which ended man's era there. Son, what you are seeing here is a human cloning facility. Cloning? I know this as much, but it will make sense after we explain. Please, don't be scared. We're here. Okay. This cloning facility is the only thing keeping humanity alive. Human survival is declining. If it reaches its final point, this facility should be ready to pick up where it left off. This field is an experimental encampment conducted by the Ministry of Offense of the United Settlements of America. Son, human cloning is very important. It has become vital to the human heritage in terms of tradition, morals, economics, Nostalgia, most importantly. These embryos you see here are clone embryos. Extracted from the human animated suspension while the humans were in space travel. The bioorganic cryopods and ships. You've heard of them. I thought they were just folklores. That's what the power structure always intends to be. In order to further the agenda of a profession. The United Centrist Theocratic Regime just stole these embryos without human consent. It was for the best. The human race must stand strong against the resurgence of Saka. Ex-Celestials can't be trusted. You don't know, kiddo. You touched us in many ways. We had to tell you. You had to know the truth. What's in there? <laughs> That's the vault, son. We don't ever go in there. In there is where me and my wife's first problem started. We were there on Earth's final days, where we were born. We've had conspiracy theories ever since. We were captured and placed here until so much time spent in this field convinced us we were wrong. And Jaimingo was right. The regime was right. Audie, if we die, this moment is enough to convince us that we need you to leave this facility. If humanity falls, if it is even inferior, after our time has passed, repopulated, even if you have to wipe them all out. They're just going to do it to themselves in the end. They're inaccurately insustainable. Okay. And no. Huh? Adoption agency. Me. Delivered. Karma. You did your jobs. And I certainly did mine. I'm going to sleep now. What are you talking about? Stop it! Audie! 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 He's unconscious! Give him to me. Audie! 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 Oh my god. He was a robot! We've been invaded! <laughs>
walk down this facility and get some more out. So, sir, do you want to step outside and see this? Mr. Jumango is on his way. What's his ETA? Less than 30 minutes. What's Feliotis' status? He's in great condition. Take me to him. Yes, sir. The Predestar has arrived. I see. I would assume they're here for you. Yes. Then you know what you must face. I am prepared to accept my fate.